Wow, hello my people. Thanks for subscribing to my channel. Your wish has always been my command. Thanks always. Well, meanwhile, this is another one. All right, this is another one. 400 lawyers available to provide free legal representation for hashtag NSAS protesters. Falano. Human rights lawyer Femi Falano has confirmed that number of lawyers that at least 400 lawyers signified interest to provide free legal services to Nigerians under detention for protesting against brutality and extrajudicial killings perpetrated by the country's police officers deployed to Special Anti-Robbery Squad SAS unit. Falano said this was their contribution towards ensuring none of the Nigerians detained, especially youths, were denied their fundamental human rights and that the Nigerian Bar Association NBA has also thrown their weight behind the protesters. Falano, in an interview with a national television on Tuesday, stated that this was the first time a huge number of legal practitioners would be backing protesters in the country with their services. He said, I am happy to announce that not less than 400 lawyers are volunteered to render pro bono services to the detainees and this is the first time that a huge number of legal practitioners have decided to come out and support protesters. Even the Nigerian Bar Association NBA has also decided to get involved in the entire protest. The legal practitioner who is chairman Alliance on Surviving COVID-19 and Beyond further outlined measures that could quell the ongoing protest across the country. According to him, the federal government must implement recommendations contained in the Tony Ojuku Judicial Panel of 2018 and that the solutions outlined in the report go beyond SARS disbandment. Aside from that, Falano argued that the government must set up a judicial commission of inquiry that would investigate alleged killings of protesters and policemen as well as implement laws already enacted by the National Assembly for funding the police especially on welfare. He added the training of the police as to change particularly what happens in police colleges is primitive. The young men and women were often ordered to shave their heads and others. They need to be treated like undergraduate universities and have human rights courses included in their curriculum. No Nigerian should be arrested in view of criminal suspect or for a civil wrong, for instance, arresting a man's wife after disappearing or for not appearing at the police station. All right, and that has been said so far. Well, meanwhile, Nigerians have on their own said a lot about this. And as it is, guests are said that is it having a good number of lawyers that makes one win a case or having valid arguments? All right. Why you know make am 1000 judiciary a most corrupted organization in Nigeria? The choice of God is saying that those 400 lawyers cannot deceive us. They can't represent us, the youth, until the successful protests before they know that everything is wrong in this country. So they want us to believe in them and possibly go behind, get bribed by the desperate government on an office user's shine. A lot of comments are, came, uh, are coming in right now. And then Uncle Femi, we know our lawyers and their characters, even the entire judiciary. Where were you when petrol pump price and electricity tariff were jacked up? We can never forget your actions, criticism, the 
your actions criticizing the government of good luck jonathan you joined ends to bring in this administration now that things are going awkward you are talking about million lawyers for protesters revolution here we come all right and then um, you no know, a lot of things have been said and i was so shocked to have you no know, stumbled on a video of pastor prophet tb joshua rada he said something seven years ago about revolution he said the revolution there will be a protest and people will be protesting placard everywhere that is was just in the vision but the government just need to listen to the youth that is the solution they should put the youth in a place of power because most of the leaders they are old yet they don't want to leave that seat and it's causing problem in the in the country that revolution now, that is what they are talking about. That he has said, he said, I watched the video, I was like, wow. He said this about 13, eh, seven years ago. That was since July 2013. I have, I have no published that video and I've talked about it. When you check my other post that I've done before, you get to see it. You'll be shocked. Things are happening. May the good Lord help us. Well, the solution has been said in that video. When you watch it, you understand what I'm talking about. God bless Nigeria. Okay. Obi one has said that the Universe Senior Advocate of Nigeria, Chief Femi Falano, the People's General, has spoken. May God continue to bless and flourish you and your family. Please set up legal aid centers across the country. Hmm. Things are really happening. May the good Lord continue to help us. Since we work out for good, Nigerians should just be calm. They will listen to us. The youth are doing their job. The, the president has said earlier that the youth are lazy. That the youth are lazy. Now, the youth are now showing to the world that they are not lazy. You can see most of them protesting. Overnight, many of them didn't come home. They slept under the bridge. We saw a lot of things that happened because they want a change. The kind of energy that the youth have in this country, if they channel that kind of energy abroad they most of most of our youth will not will not be tattered they will not be hungry most of our youth will be very very rich as in multi-millionaire rich if that kind of energy we have that kind of knowledge we have if they can allow us if the government can em empower this youth and somebody has been saying this youth are lazy hmm. it's now they will know that youth nigerian youth are not lazy Hmm. I was surprised. A lot of them, they faced it. What is happening? Waiting, self. Waiting. Person go go school, finish, self. Get first class. You don't get a job. Waiting. What is happening? What is going on? We can't continue like this. That's what the youth have been talking about. And that is it. Well, that is it, my people, on this one. Well, let me have more takes from you on this. And remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks and God bless.